The opening and closing ceremonies for the 2017 Universiade have been moved from Taipei Dome to Taipei Municipal Track and Field Stadium. Mayor Koenja criticized the work schedule in Taipei Dome as being unreliable and not leaving enough time for interior furnishings and decoration. The contractor for Glory Land Development said it regretted the city's decision. Concerns about the completion of the Taipei Dome over the next two years led the Taipei City government to resort to a backup plan, which involves moving both the opening and closing ceremonies of the 2017 Universiade to a nearby track and field stadium. Taipei Municipal Track and Field Stadium already held the Deaf Olympics, and many of its facilities have been upgraded over the past few years. As for Taipei Dome construction, when you add interior furnishings, it's just too unreliable. The move won't come without a trade-off, as the Taipei Dome has a planned capacity of 40,000 spectators. The Taipei Municipal Track and Field Stadium can only accommodate 20,000. City officials said there is a precedent for such a move. Original preparations for the 2011 Universiade in Shenzhen included a 70,000-seat venue, though it was later moved to a venue that only held 20,000 seats. City officials plan to wait until the Guangzhou Universiade this July before applying to the governing committee to change venues. This could lead to the possibility that Taipei Dome won't even hold a single event. At the moment, judging by the progress on Taipei Dome, the probability is quite slim. During the bidding process, the Universiade chairman visited Far Glory to be briefed on the sports venue and the Taipei Dome's sporting facilities. He gave a good evaluation. We regret the decision to move to another site. Far Glory also took the opportunity to respond to Ko's criticism that it's unreliable by saying it could complete the project if given enough time. 